Hey guys, welcome back to another reaction. We got the first trailer for Zombieland Double Tap, the sequel to one of my favorite horror comedy. I think it's like the first movie that made me go, oh, you know what? Horror and comedy can go together really, really well. Honestly, like right now, I can't think of another movie that combine the two genres so, so beautifully. Yeah, I can't, I can't really think of anything. Actually, though, The Visit by M. Night Shyamalan. That was a good one. But, enough about that. Let's talk about Zombieland. Um, Ruben Flesher, who I think is a really talented director. I, I think the, the first Zombieland movie is the, the one that you know got him the Venom jobs. Um, even though the, the Venom movie wasn't as good as um, many people hoped it, it would be. Um, I, I still have hope. In, in you know zombie land double tap and hopefully this movie is gonna get him back to the you know the the, the winning uh, streak um, what else did he do he did a uh, gangster gangster squad gangster squad with um, uh, Josh Brolin I think and Emma Stone and Ryan Gosling a very underrated movie in my opinion um, so he's back directing the second one. Uh, all the cast from the first movie with Harrison, Jesse Eisenberg, uh, Abigail Bre is it Breslin or Breslin or something like that, right? And uh, of course Emma Stone is back. And I, I think I read somewhere that um, Bill Murray is also back, but he's dead. So is he playing a zombie version of himself? I, I don't know. But apparently he's back, and let's see if he's if he's in the trailer. Making your audience scare and laugh are two very different things. So, you know, when you watch a horror comedy, you gotta give the writers and the directors a lot of credits. Yeah. Here we go. Volumes up. Boom. That title card looks like a video game title. Mm -hmm. Sorry, just you in that chair. I think it would have made a damn fine president. <laughs> would have brought a real Living in the White House. You're welcome, America. Killing zombie in the White House, bro. Life. This is... Life is about more than just survival. We were a family. Dysfunctional, sure. But what family isn't? Merry Christmas. What would you like, little girl? I'd really like for you to stop calling me little girl. But do you know what I would like? I don't give a shit what you <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Bro. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Hi, I'm Columbus. Madison. This is Tallahassee. Hey, Paul Blart. Is this your dad? Oh, oopsie. I forgot the seatbelt rule. Oh, so she knows the rules? I told her just a few of them. 73, and are there more? You're cute. I like it. My sister is gone. She picked up a boy. He's from Berkeley. Berkeley. You don't have weed. You. Do I look like the type of person that would have weed? I'm sorry. Boom. Yeah. I have nothing against hippies. I just want to beat the shit out of them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hippies. Start talking. You first. That's amazing. Oh my god. You know what? I hope. Um, what was it? <laughs> well, well, well. 
Look at look at that look at that title card. That is straight up a video game title card, and I love it. Well, um, man, listen, a zombie apocalypse sounds terrifying, but if it looks like that, I want it. <laughs> if me and it's just a couple of friends can like, you know, take over the world, live in the White House and just hunt zombies. Sounds hella fun. It's a great trailer, but my only concern is that it is very funny, and I like it, but I didn't really see any horror element in it, you know what I mean? Like when, and like from a, um, from a marketing point of view, I do believe that is, it is better to, uh, to present your movie as a comedy movie rather than a horror movie even though horror movie they make money sure but audience members they go into the movie they want to have a good time and if you can kind of promise them a good time which this, this trailer definitely did a lot of a lot more people is going to show up so i think right now i'm not i'm not saying that the movie won't be scary i'm just saying they are Either purposely or, you know, um, unpurposely, is that even a word? Um, hiding the, the scary parts, the, the, the horror elements. Which is fine. I mean, the first movie got some scary moments, sure. But it was more comedy than, than horror. But still, it was still a horror movie. From the trailer, I did not get the vibe of a horror movie. Um, so that's just my little, my little concern. It's not even a nitpick, it's a concern. Because it's only a trailer. I don't know if the movie is gonna be scary or not. I'm just saying from the trailer, it does not look scary. And if I'm going to see a horror, horror comedy, I want, I, I want to laugh, sure. But I also want to be scared. You know what I'm talking about? So, and also is uh, the the action se uh, sequences looks awesome. Um, I hope I hope they bring back the what is it the kill of the week kill of the day or something like that. Excuse me. Where uh, Columbus he he got like uh, like most creative kill or some something like that right. Um, and from the trailer I saw a lot of great kills. So yeah, I hope, hope I hope they bring it back and. Yeah, du Double Tap is actually a really good title because that's actually one of the rules, I think. I'll always, you know, go for the Double Tap to make sure that the zombie is dead. Um, overall, a really great trailer. I enjoy very much. did not see Bill Murray, but apparently he's in the movie. Um, so, yeah, we'll, I guess we'll see. Zombie Land, Double Tap, official trailer. Number one on trending. Have you seen it? Let me know in the comment section how you feel about it. Do you like it? Do you not like it? If you enjoy, also, also here's my question: What is your favorite all-time favorite uh, horror comedy movie? So yeah, let me know in the comment section as well. And if you enjoy my reaction, hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to see more reactions like this, with that being said, I'll see you soon.